What's your opinion on anteaters? Oh no, anteaters. don't don't do this bit. This is I mean, oh, they, oh. they're very, they they have ant in their name. Mhm, mm mhm. Mm is that a good thing? Would you say? I mean, I mean, I've seen an anteater in a zoo. Yeah, what do you think of them? Uh, they're cute. They especially if they have a baby on their back. I've like got to go. <laughs> Okay, goodbye. Bye. He, do he doesn't like any of That's one thing like. you should know about him. Oh, uh, you, yeah, you really messed up there. I mean, don't start a conversation about something you don't like then. You Yee! don't come at me with your anteater forgiveness, all right? How about that? How about I'll start a conversation about what I want to talk about, in this case, my hatred of a putrid animal. And then you, you tell me how much you hate a putrid animal. And we'll Are stay on good terms. We'll stay on good terms. That's how I stand there, right? Anteaters are unequivocally, unequivocally the worst <laughs> animal. Listen, listen. The problem with anteaters right one imagine being named after the thing you eat what unoriginal person did that number two <laughs> they just look weird they're wrong they're long and they're just have you seen their tails yeah i hate them hate them no, i hate yeah, it gotta, gotta I... calm down <laughs> it's a bloody anteater calm down <laughs> seriously I I am not okay tommy why did you agree to do this i i, I didn't know she was oh I, sorry i didn't mean to leave I didn't know she was going to be so crude. I was also, I'm going to be honest, I didn't know how, I didn't know how vigorous your opinions were. I've been broke so many times, I don't know what to believe. It's my fault, it's my fault, wear my heart on my sleeve. Wilbur, Wilbur, will you defend me, please? I've been thinking... I've been thinking a lot about anteaters recently, and I just, I think they're just ridiculous looking and awful animals. I think whoever designed the anteater, okay, two, two things, two issues I have, right? Number one, they look fucking ridiculous, like, like pointlessly, stupidly designed. Their tails look like a fucking broom. Like, it looks like, it looks like someone just attached a broom, and the tail, it just, it's like twice the size of the actual body of the anteater, right? Ridiculous. And its face looks stupid. It's like, it, it's like the shape of like a semicircle, the entire body of the creature. Ridiculous. Bad animal. Animal, right not only that but they named it ant eater like can you imagine if they called humans burger eaters or some shit like fuck it who came up with this bullshit it just pisses me off they're bad animals and i hate them take it up with god wilbur that that's very very interesting wilbur. just look at a picture yeah, tell us more there's this thing called an okapi which is like a deer and a zebra had a baby and it looks equally ridiculous Hello? Do you know anteaters, they also, their tongues are like coated in this like <laughs> sticky stuff, right? And the whole thing is they jam it into like the ant hill, okay? And then when they pull it back, it's like all the ants stuck to it. Imagine Your how body dirt language they is eat. really imagine how much full on dirt right they now. Eat, Tommy, Tommy, imagine how much dirt they eat with the ants. I mean, I don't know. I mean, you ever seen Arthur, Wilbur? I have. On I PBS? Have. I, I don't know what that is, but I've seen that. What Arthur. is PBS? PBS, like, um,. Is that some American Private shit? Broadcasting yeah. service or something. God, you, you Americans love your pop culture, don't you? Look, it's just anteaters, bro. I just, I've got my video. You should try and be more like Wilbur, George. He's, he's, yeah. Can, can you get I've been doing a lot of thinking. That's cool. took, what are you thinking about, Wilbur? I don't know, but here, I have another Still anteaters, honestly. Okay. I, I, I've still got a lot to sort of mull over. Yeah, fair enough. Hey, do you want to know something fucking weird this about dolphins, Wilbur? Our team's war flag for tomorrow. Well, but you know dolphins use like weird ass sounds to think. It's so, it's fucked you up. Anteaters have no teeth. How do you know that? It's just, he, he, it's just a common one. fact. I thought it's everyone knew that. Those dreadful animals, dude. They literally have no teeth. I guess you don't need teeth if you eat ants. <laughs> they just I suck them up. Don't. They just yeah, absorb you'd shit. You'd know, wouldn't you, Goggy? You'd know. <laughs> no, I, <don't> know. <laughs> yeah, I don't use my teeth when I eat the ants. Wow, I just kind of like I use my tongue. I just do this. You just yes. suck shit. Crush them against the roof of my the roof of my hey, mouth. Hey Tommy, that's oh. probably enough oh, how I eat everything. <laughs> this is a boring conversation. Yeah, yeah. yeah what do I need? About ant eaters. What do I need okay. to do next? So, oh, ant eaters fuck. belong to the What's same group as like echidnas and and aardvarks and things. Right? Also, yeah. my Sam, stop. And, 
Do you know the thing? The thing that's that really nice. bothers me about them, right, is that the majority of anteaters are pretty normal looking. Like if you if you look up different kinds of anteater, the majority of them is the giant anteater. You know the ones with the, you know the ones with the with the, the. Well, they're not actually that big. They're just kind of regular. They're they're, they're anteater size. I would go as far as to say. And yeah. they just they're the ones with the long snouts with the big old tongues, right? But the thing is, their tails are the things that put me off because it just looks like another like furry anteater strapped on the back of the regular anteater and i hate it i hate the way that their tongues are long and sticky i hate the fact that they eat what their fucking namesake is and i just I, what else do they identify with apart from the fact that they eat ants like they could have just picked anything else in the whole they, world they eat thirty thousand a day what where do they find that many ants because there's there's more ants on in the planet than there are humans oh no that's way true. you know what i that's, hate about that's them? very true that's you know what really what do ants them? even know about? What's even? Their what do they low think? Body temperature, thirty-two point <laughs> seven Celsius. Like, who? What do they think? That's they not. Are, actually, that's not even that low. Serious. That's, that's serious. not. I mean, that's low, but it's like no. not. What's, what's normal body? What are your body temp temps? I just feel like I just feel. Oh, I can actually find that out for you right now. I have a I have a thermometer next to me. Thirty-seven. Thirty-seven. 37. Oh, so you're about you. You kind of uh, very similar yeah. to an anteater in a lot of ways, then, Wilbur. Oh, six degrees lower. It's way colder. You watch your. Mouth, Tommy. I mean, you're very, very similar to an anteater. They think they can just have a lower body temperature and be more efficient because they don't have to heat them, I'm, their I'm, bodies I'm, up as I'm, much. I'm, I'm George, that. George, I've really enjoyed this conversation, but Tommy's just pissed me off so much. I'm uh, yeah, I'm just, I mean, you. Boom, 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 boom,